Okay, in this video, I'm going to share with you how to set up um, your Traffic Wave account with Traffic Zip. So here we are in Traffic Zip. Um, you're going to want to set up your autoresponder. So when you go to Account, Edit Profile, down here you'll see autoresponder code and this box here will be blank so this is where we'll want to paste our autoresponder code once we get it from traffic wave so we're going to go to our traffic wave account and the first thing you're going to want to do when you're logged in is click on um, campaign manager here then on the left hand side here you'll see create new campaign And then you'll see campaign nickname. Um, this can be anything you want. So for this, we'll just type traffic zip2. And we'll verify nickname. Okay, and this you don't have to worry about. We'll just click move to step two. Okay, and then the return email name. So here we'll put our name. And then for here, we're going to put the return email address and the campaign title we'll just call it traffic zip 2 for this video okay then we'll scroll down and we'll move on to step 3 and this is um, your address for the bottom of your emails when you send somebody an email we'll just use postal address from my traffic wave um, profile so it will automatically pull everything in move to step 4 and by default it's going to um, have the name and email address selected and this is what is going to display on your website form is going to be asking for the people's name and email address um, when they fill out your form so that's everything that we need there so we're just going to move down to step five um, if you want to be sent an email when somebody fills out your um, form you can check this box um, if you don't want to be sent an email then just leave it checked um, it doesn't really matter it's up to you personal preference so when you're done that scroll down um, you'll have to say I've read and agree the above requirements we will check that and we'll hit finish okay then we'll say great take me to the letters tab okay so here we are um, now what you're going to want to do is go up to capture page capture pages slash forms and you're going to want to click on capture forms and you're going to want to create customize HTML form um, for a description again we're just going to use traffic zip 2 for this video this can be anything you want um, here your capture page form parameters um, we're going to want to change the subscription landing URL and confirm landing URL. Um, on the main page of Traffic Zip, you'll see down here under step one, it says make sure your redirect URL is set to Traffic Zip sign up. So the sign up process works flawlessly. So what we'll do is we'll take this, hit adjust parameters. Um, you can enable Java check in if you want, doesn't really matter we'll enable it so we'll change the subscription URL to sign up and we'll change the confirm URL to these two that we copied from traffic zip then we'll hit adjust and return so the two URLs are there now so now all we gotta do is save our custom form data then over here it'll say get HTML down here now you'll copy the JavaScript so just click in here right click copy now we go back to our traffic zip account so we go to account edit profile and we come down here to autoresponder in this white box we'll remove this code for now and we'll right click paste in our traffic wave code 
Okay, and we'll have to change out these little tabs. They have single ones. We'll need to make them double. Just like this. And then hit update. That's why it failed the last time. So profile successfully updated. So now if we go back to edit profile, you'll see here's our form. Now we want to preview, make sure it works. Preview autoresponder form. Here's what it'll look like here. And then if you enter in our name and our email, hit submit. And it'll take us to the traffic zip sign up. So that's how you set up your traffic wave account using traffic zip.